The picture is one of the identification of the age of a culture and lifestyle in ancient times. There have been many pictures that tell of life painted on the walls of the cave that identify ancient life. Ancient people also often told the greatness of their culture through pictures, as in Egypt. Recently found images that are thousands of years old. Where is it? Watch this video till the end. A team of researchers from Universitas Kristin Satyawakana, UKSW, have documented 1,000-year-old paintings in the remains of a church, located southwest of the Third Cataract on the west bank of the Nile in Sudan. The paintings were found in 2021 by the University of Khartoum, University of the Nile Valley, and VU, and Sudanese archaeologists. The church has a primary nave and two small side naves, constructed from dried mud brick and a lining layer of burnt bricks. Several Greek inscriptions have been identified on some of the surviving walls, while within the sanctuary several paintings have survived despite considerable damage to the structure. At the time of the initial discovery, the team lacked the conservators and experts to preserve the paintings, so the decision was made to rebury the church ruins in order to protect the paintings from the elements. In the latest study, the researchers found that one of the better preserved paintings on the eastern wall of the sanctuary shows the bust of Christ Emmanuel against the background of a standing figure, believed to be icon of Our Lady of the Sign showing the Virgin Mary. Dr. Magdalena Laptes, who specializes in Nubian iconography at the Institute of Art History at UKSW said, This type of representation is called platyteratone uranon, more spacious than the heavens. It means that the womb of the mother is greater than the heavens, containing the unlimited and eternal God. Perhaps the origins of this idea can be found in the pre-Christian vision of the Egyptian goddess Nut, who swallows and gives birth to the sun. Flanking this image are two archangels at her sides, both dressed in richly decorated ceremonial attire and shoes embroidered with pearls. The heads of both figures are incomplete, but the researchers believe that they likely depict the archangels Michael and Gabriel. Laptas commented that this type of representation in Nubian art was unknown. At the same time, it confirms the strong Byzantine influence, she noted. The paintings date from between 9th and 11th century AD, a period when the Nubian kingdoms located between the 1st and 6th cataracts on the Nile formed an important Christian cultural center.